hey there welcome back to my channel in today's video i am going to show you how you can make patio makeover in easy and affordable way so this is my patio which is pretty in decent size 7 by 15 feet long you may also notice the floor of the patio is little bumpy and uneven so that is the reason i wanted to do a patio makeover so my kid can come out and play this is a turf grass from Home Depot. You can also buy it from Amazon. I personally like go to the store and check the quality of turf so I can make sure that it is safe for pets and kids. So this is the main entrance of the Home Depot where you also get to see varieties of plants. Once you enter in the Home Depot at the end, you will find a top section. Now we are at top section where you get to see the variety of turf. All the tops are 12 feet long and then you get to choose the width. The one which I ordered was 7 by 12 feet long. If you are not sure about the calculations then Home Depot staff can help you to do the calculations and accordingly you can choose the top. The roll is pretty decent in size and light in weight that can easily fit in your car and you can carry them to your home. So this is the final look for the turf. As you see here, you don't have to put grass pieces together as it's giving full coverage and grass is looking so real. For the extra turf, you can make marks with the marker and that can be easily cut with the rep cutter. As you see here, it is so simple to cut with the rep cutter. The back of the turf is made out of plastic and that can be easily cut with this cutter. This is a picture of the rug cutter and this is this was the actual rug cutter that I was using. I purchased this from Home Depot and this is also available on Amazon. I have added a link in the description below for your reference. As you see here it is so simple and easy to cut with this rug cutter. This is the closer look. You can see how simple it is to cut the turf. Similarly, you can make small adjustment at the corner. You can make a mark with the marker and then you can cut the extra turf Once you are done with the cutting, then make sure all edges are covered with the turf. And here is a finished look for the turf. You can see here all the edges are well covered. These tiles are from IKEA. 
each box has nine pieces and I order for the three boxes each tile size is one by one in feet so one box can cover up to nine square feet of area I'm placing the tiles on the turf to know how much area that tiles can cover So this is the initial design that I was thinking of and then I switched to the other design. Now I'm making marking on the turf to cut the extra turf so I can make space for the tiles. These tiles are easy to install, you just have to overlap it on each other and then press it until it clicks. You can also use your hands to for the pressing the tiles and make sure that tiles are locked. I was using wood hammer and I found it was pretty convenient for me. And this is how the wooden floor look like. I really like how these tiles have created the pattern. To cover the other side, use the extra turf. make small adjustment as is needed you can cut the extra turf and make small adjustments at the corner or near to the poles so from the wood tile side make small adjustments uh, for the turf you can cut the extra turf and then you can make the level adjustments so the tile and the turf will be in the similar level and uh, for the extra floor that uh, you see here you can cut the pieces of the turf and add them to the floor And here is the finished look for the patio. This artificial grass looks so real and the good part is this wooden tiles are very well complementing the grass. You can add patio furniture as per your need. So this is how my patio look like before the makeover.
and this is the new look of my patio after the makeover i have added these three extra tiles in front of the storage door and this is the new look of my patio that you see here the grass is so real and i really like the texture of the grass and those wooden tiles are complementing well and it is very convenient if you sit on the patio furniture so you can always have a wooden floor and then if kids want to play they can always have a grass floor I really like how it has a separation between the wood and the grass floor. So let me know what do you think about this patio makeover. Add comments below and don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for watching this video.